I had really no idea what I wanted to do or if I even wanted to stay in school. I started wagging school because I was sick of it and I didn't want to do it anymore. Without VCAL, I probably wouldn't have finished high school at all. A lot of students that are enrolled in VCAL are kids that enjoy the practical side of school, the more hands-on side. In an average VCAL class, no two students learn the same. Each student is able to learn in their own way and their own time. It gives students who may not succeed in, in a mainstream learning environment um, the opportunity to succeed. They start that new pattern of learning, I can do something and I am good. Give them a taste of success and uh, build their confidence. From Vico I have learnt that if you have confidence you obviously have a better self-esteem and you will succeed in your career and in life. VCAL builds self-esteem because you're treated more like an adult. I've seen the difference in, in, in students from when they've come into the program to when they've left the program. We're motivating them, we're engaging them. To actually see them leave school and just become, you know, dynamic and useful members of the community, I think that's, that's wonderful. VCAL caters for different people wanting to explore different pathways. By being involved in projects outside of our regular classroom. Most students spend on average two to three days outside of the classroom or out of the school. It gives us many opportunities to explore different working environments. Different courses and workplaces. It really gives students the opportunity to adapt to their own environment, to make different friends. To be able to go into unknown situations or handle themselves with employers. And getting them to transfer those skills into the workplace is really satisfying. My course is an automotive. Doing this course while still at school reduces the time spent on my apprenticeship and gives me the experience I need in the workplace. And it really sets them up for early entry into employment. Another part of the program is structured work placement, which lets you do on-the-job training in the career of your choice, which is also one day a week. Hi, my name's Rob. I'm the manager of Action Tree Services in Chelsea. We took on a VCAL student. He worked with us one day a week, and it worked out really well, so we took him on full-time, and he's still working with us today. As an employer, what I want to see in the young kids is them having a real crack at it, and I believe that VCAL is a great way for the young kids to get out and get into the workforce and get their hands dirty. Doing VCAL will get you out of the classroom and out into the real world while still learning and completing Year 12. VCAL respects and promotes individuality. It provides us with a learning environment that we're happy to be in. That way we achieve our best at school, TAFE and work. Freeze Frame Project was a collaboration between um, Lawn VCAL students and the Lawn Historical Society. They had a catalogue of fantastic historical photos and they were in a state of disrepair. We suddenly realised that we could use multimedia skills to bring this sort of um, collection of static photos into a more of a dynamic presentation and from there we ended up making a little seven minute documentary. We were invited as guests to uh, present our film at the Lawn Theatre. Building of relationships up with members um, of the community that the students didn't even know it existed. So the eStore is an online shop where students can produce work and sell their work. Kids can make whatever they want. The Vet Auto boys, they got pistons out of cars, old wrecked cars, and then they made clocks out of them. We had a whole group that used reclaimed timber and they made um, beautiful handmade chopping boards. But it's been really a success because every student has made something and something is a little bit different. When we arrived in Borneo, the students were totally responsible for the decision making. That is booking their accommodation, organising transport, sourcing food and general coordination and logistics of, of the trip. Having to deal with situations such as calculating foreign exchange rates, they are having to break down communication to, to the most simple form. Once they got over there, they sort of really got the embedded life skills. They had to accept full responsibility, they had to take on board leadership roles, you know, they had to live by the decisions they made. My son Ben suffers from a unusual chronic bone condition 
chronic recurrent multifocal osteomyelitis. Which has resulted him over the years missing a lot of school. His special needs teacher came to me and said, what about VPEL? It was amazing the difference it made to him. I came home talking about school for once and saying good things. He went to Borneo for 28 days and he came back an absolute different person. As soon as I got on the plane to Borneo, there's just something about me like I thought I want a new start. Socially and emotionally, he, he just grew as a person through that and it's continued in his life beyond school. When I came back, I, I felt like a completely new man. VCAL for life to me means that you're really setting yourself up for life. Because you can make VCAL whatever you want it to be. It has scope to do anything and everything. You know, we worked with our hands a lot, we got out and explored a lot. They actually experience real life opportunities. And really get them into work yeah, and into the real world. I just loved it. I loved it a lot more than normal school. And at the end of the day, it makes a huge difference in students' lives. VCAL for life.